game Saturday. You know, you said missing those first three games, you you sort of learned something. What what did you learn just from missing that time? Uh, just like how you gotta, like uh, I'm not there. I just kind of still find another role on this team because I call it doing it on the field. So it's kind of like meeting sort of all during camp, the young guys coming in, helping them out, um, trying to get the uh, older guys, even older guys, getting them ready. Um, I'm like now it's. Not, I remember my freshman year. I'm like I'm a junior now, so I'm considered one of them older guys. It's flies by, so I'm trying to encourage the freshmen, um, sophomores, even some of them seniors, pick them up, uh, so we can start this thing in the right direction. Has that sort of grown you up, matured you, made you a little more of a leader? I uh, definitely. Uh, I say, like those three weeks, I was kind of still just. It's like I couldn't do. I only could only do so much. But then it's a Saturday when the first game, that's my first game back, kind of. Uh, Felt that leadership role more, like way more. Uh, as soon as they like, we took off the travel, and the game started pregame. I just like, I felt a wave of energy over me. I think it helped out the team a little bit. So. Looks like to me you played the game real physical on Saturday. Were you surprised after the layoff that you're able to be able to be as physical as you were? Uh, definitely not because uh, that's what I've been preparing for uh, the whole off season. The time I wasn't playing uh, in the weight room, um, just really just taking my anger out too that was my first game back so I was trying to was trying to go hard every play so is it nice to get back in the routine of things I mean during the week preparing for an opponent and not just oh, yeah uh, it feels good um, you don't really know how much you loved it until it's like it's gone and kind of felt like it was gone and now like every day I come in here I don't take anything for granted um, I go and take this every day like hard um, everything I got to do to try to do it right perfect so Definitely. How tough was it for the team to to lose a couple big games and you not be able to contribute? Uh, it was tough, but like we never know what happened. Even if I was there, like I came back Saturday, we still didn't win. So we're all just trying to get this thing together, uh, all together, trying to get it right. Um, we'll definitely get it right. Um, I think it's like this whole like uh, since the beginning of the season, it's kind of been just a we're learning the song and we're like you said, a young team, but we got stuff up now. So I think those games are out the way, it's time to step it up. Did you uh, when you watch the video? Did you see, see the old Jordan uh, from what you uh, used to play uh, when you were a freshman as sophomore? Uh, definitely. I um, I would say I was it's just like that's like that's how I play. So coaches, uh, but Coach Narduzzi just been I owe it to the team. I owe it to everybody just to play hard. And when I feel it, I just thought about like every play, just uh, missed them games, just maybe um, miss those games. So I gotta I gotta step up and lead this team. When Coach Narduzzi told you about the suspension, was there anybody you talked to specifically that kind of you know lifted your spirits a little bit? Uh, everybody around here did. Um, there was not a person that was that wasn't on my side. Everybody in here was on my side. Uh, family outside of here, people, everybody was on my side. Anything else? What uh, what, what if any effect was there from rust? I guess was was there anything at all that you? Thought to yourself, okay, if, if I hadn't missed those three games, I'd have been able to do that. Or did, did uh, any, any, did you feel, did you notice any difference in your play because you had missed three games? So you're saying if I, did I know any difference in my play? Yeah, I, I mean, did you feel like, I mean, did you feel behind in any way? Uh, definitely not. Um, I got reps during camp, uh, practice during, during those games I wasn't missing. I was practicing, so I say it was, it's like just like I played last week or the week before that. Uh, I was ready. Did you plan for Georgia Tech ahead of time? Because, I mean, you, you knew that was going to be your first game back. You know? um, yeah, I was watching film with the, the guys all. We were watching, we played Youngstown. I was watching film with Youngstown. So I was kind of on their schedule, just yeah. um, doing what they do. It, was, it wasn't anything. I wasn't missing anything. It was regular. How many carries do you want this week? <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's, the, that's not the coach, but uh, he got a plan for everything, and I'm sure he'll, he'll know what to do. Are you surprised he had you on both sides of the ball in your first game? Uh, no, no, that's how, that's what you guys expect from Coach Nardo. He just he'll he'll pull out anything.